all right hey guys so welcome back to the channel it is just me right now obviously my other half is not here um me and kim are doing prep in packs separate ones so i don't know which one is going to be going up first so it's this one welcome um we're gonna start packing for vegas i'm really excited packing is like one of my favorite things to do sorry if the lighting is terrible um it's really just muggy and dark outside not much i can do so we're just in my room right now you guys have seen this many times um we're just gonna get started i actually don't know how kim is gonna edit this hey kim she edits these videos if the prep will go first or the pack because I'm going to be filming just kind of like um, it all mixed together. But today, I'll tell you guys what I have planned. If I could just get my phone out. <laughs> There's the ball. Also, I just like quickly threw on some makeup because I literally woke up not too long ago. So today, I need to fake tan. I need to bring money and take money from the bank um, like American. Um... And then I'm going to start um, kind of like my face prepping. So I shave like my sideburns and like mustache. And then I have to do my eyebrows. I have to dye them. Um, I think I'm going to put on my nails today. I have like these press-ons, which I'll show you. Um, yeah, I have like filming from London Drugs. So you guys can see that. And then I need to deep condition my hair. And then tomorrow, like overnight and tomorrow I'll wash it. Which I'll show you guys that. And then pack. So that's what I have planned for today and then tomorrow I'm getting my toast done and then we leave and I'm so excited okay so let's go get my luggage I don't know which one I'm gonna get Ugh. also I know I look really tired because I am I didn't really sleep well so you guys never really seen this part of my house the hallway okay it's like super dark <laughs> um Oh, such a cute shot. I always have to make sure there's no spiders. Oh, there is one. Oh my god. It's fucking huge. Do you see that? Focus. Oh, that gives me the heebie jeebies. Okay. I'm gonna get out of here real quick. Oh, fucking hell. Oh. <gasps> oh, there's another one. Oh my god. That one is fucking huge oh my god i better not have walked into a goddamn web okay <laughs> so i had to go check my hair and make sure that there was nothing on me but we got the suitcase up here so it is i don't know like what size to tell you guys um but i would say it's like a medium luggage let me film in my mirror I would say it's like a medium sized luggage, so I have to, it's one of the ones you have to check in. So let's pack this baby up. Okay, so oh my god, this battery is dying really quick. So, um, this guy here is just like what I'm gonna be bringing as my carry on bag that goes under the seat, and I'm gonna be putting a lot of basically my nicer pieces in here because. I just have really bad luck in losing my luggage and I want to be prepared. So certain item, items will be going in this guy. I did the same thing last year, but I did it with um, bathing suits and clubbing dresses, but I honestly couldn't care less about those things. They can go in the luggage, no problem. It's like my actual nice stuff that I want to have on me, not women in there um okay so this i don't feel like trying on i've already um i already know that it looks good basically i'm only trying things on that i need to make sure are styled correctly this clearly goes together so i don't need to do that so i'm just going to fold this guy up and then it away and that set is from Aritzia and I believe they still have it so if you guys do like any of the pieces um I can try and link the ones below that I know are actually available but a lot of the stuff is quite old but I will try and look okay so 
I'm going to show you guys all my dresses and all of these ones are going to be going in that carry-on bag with me because I just don't want to risk not having them. So this is the first dress. It's from Forever 21. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, you would have seen I did like a little mirror picture in it. It's really cute. It's long to the... It's like a midi dress, so mid calf. And it's really cute. They still have it. If they still have it, I will link it down below. So this is going to be packed in the long shot, like I said. Next, I have this one, gold silky dress um, from Maritzia. I think I have the name on here. Yeah, the Millie dress. I absolutely love it. I can't wait to style it. I just think this is like such a summer dress. Um, perfect for Vegas. So this guy, again, is going to come in the long shop. Um, it's probably going to get wrinkly, so I'm going to have to be careful. Actually, most of these dresses are probably going to get wrinkly, but I'm sure we'll have an iron. Next, I have this one. Um, this one's a midi, but they're right in the front. It goes like kind of to like where these shorts are. It looks really, really cute on. I wore this in Italy a few years ago. Um, again, yeah, Zara, this one's super super old I believe three or four years old so it's not available anymore next I'm going to bring this um, black polka dot ruffle dress this is honestly probably my favorite dress that I own um, I've already worn it <laughs> so many times but I don't care I am an outfit repeater um, yeah it's just really flattering and looks really cute um, I got this at the Ladies Scoop last year, so I don't think they'll have it, but it's from the brand 12 Rue Colette. I think Rue is street, right? Rue? So, 12 street. Don't know what Colette is, but yeah. That's the brand if you want to look. Next, this one is kind of a maybe so it's just an option I don't know if I'm actually gonna wear this but I'm bringing it just in case because it's just really cute um, simple it is uh, like apron style and I got it from Aritzi at the warehouse sale I think three years ago now but yeah so this is just an extra just in case to have um, next I have this set which I'll definitely wear it's one of my favorite pieces so it's from Zara last year and this is the top really cute and then it's just a matching little ruffly skirt I did wear this to high tea which we vlogged but I didn't really get to um, style it the way I like so I usually rewear things when that happens so this is coming with me okay and the last piece, I think, no, not the last piece, the last piece for the long shop, but that's not right. I'm bringing this silky duster from, um, again, Aritzia that I got at the warehouse sale to throw on over, um, which one is it? The, um, Aritzia dress, because it looks really cute like that, or just to throw on with, like, simple thing, like shorts, just looks makes it look a little bit more fancy so this is coming this is gonna wrinkle for sure so I gotta be careful with that okay so the last dresses besides the um, two that are coming in the Zara package tomorrow um, are the clubbing options that I have and they happen to be the only ones that are colorful minus this guy but I will be borrowing borrowing possibly this outfit from Maddie um, so you'll see that and one from Kim but I honestly don't really care about clubbing dresses um, like I did last year wasted too much money on that you wear it once and you just you know I just don't that's not really my style anymore so I just don't care about it so this guy I got two years ago now from Forever 21 and I never ended up wearing it but it's 
the cowl neck mini dress and it it's like gold black sparkly it's really cute really flattering so I most likely will wear this one of the nights um, yeah so this one is from Forever 21 so this is going in the suitcase because like I said I just don't care about these pieces <laughs> Then another two other clubbing options um, is this red dress that I have worn already twice, <laughs> both to clubs. Because again, like just it, it's really flattering and um, yeah. So it's kind of like a ready orange. It's from Sara. I've already said that, and it's just a mini dress. It's really cute, um, and I just want to be like. Because I found the dresses that are the things that I wore last year were just like kind of uncomfortable. Um, actually, what did I wear last year? I don't, I don't even remember. Whatever. I just wasted too much time thinking about clubbing stuff last year. And then this one was an option for last year that I never ended up wearing, but it's like a bright ass orange bandage dress and it looks really cute on. And yeah, didn't end up wearing it last year. So maybe this year I will wear this guy. So that is all of my dresses. And now I'm gonna fold them and show you guys how I put them away. Bloop. Okay, so all those dresses I just showed you and that silky duster is in this dust bag here, which is gonna go into the long chomp bag. And then that gingham set that I showed you, um, that extra dress and the clubbing dresses are in here and that's gonna go in my suitcase because they're like extras and stuff I don't care about. <laughs> so now I'm gonna show you the other outfits that are sets rather than a dress. Sorry Kim, you're gonna have to make a lot of cuts. This lace long sleeve bodysuit with this midi skirt from Maritzia because it has like the white lace. So that is an outfit. Also, I'm not sure. I might also wear that mini skirt with this top or this one. I have a lot of options for that guy there. Um, so yeah, I have like a bunch of miscellaneous chops that can go with um, certain pieces, they're just extras. It's always nice to have extras. Also just to wear with like jean shorts or whatever. So I got this blouse. Um, yeah, I have another lace bodysuit and then a bunch of crop tops. So just options for different things. Um, more um, just crop tops this one's just a really casual top so and then two skirt options here for um, some of those tops um, and then I have a skirt coming in that Zara haul that I will wear with one of those tops as well so only those two or sorry three there are actually um, styled together the rest I just know look good with one another so they're just kind of extras. Also, Maddie is bringing me um, a skirt and a dress that I like, so I need to have a top for that, which one of those goes really well. And yeah, so that is all of that. I'm gonna put those into their compartments and I will show you. Okay, so this is where my clubbing clothes are gonna go and casual pieces that are gonna go. So I'll show you guys that in a bit. But this is just um, a pillowcase and it has a zip so everything is gonna be enclosed and then I know that these pieces are in there when I'm unpacking. So I'm gonna put that in there and then show you guys. Okay so these are all the um, casual things that I'm bringing. So I have one pair of shorts, um, a workout outfit if we decide to work out, my, oh, sorry guys hold on, my pajamas, one sweatshirt and one long sleeve t-shirt just to wear in the hotel because it's it's cold in the hotel and then I have sweatpants for the plane. So 
that's all of that. Bikinis I'm bringing. Most of them are from Zaffle. If not, um, actually this one's from H&M. This one is from Winners, but it's Body Glove. And the rest are Zaffle. So I'm only bringing one, two, three, four, five, six bikinis. But I am borrowing one of my friends as well. Okay, here are all the shoes I'm bringing. Um, minus the runners I'm wearing on the plane. So we have four pairs of heels. Um, this one is going to be for the club because they're just like cheap, whatever. And then the rest are just cute. One pair of slides and two loafers, which are like my comfy shoes and, and runners. So, yeah. Okay, so don't mind how dirty my bathroom is, but these five things here, um, I have purple shampoo, regular shampoo, conditioner, body wash, an extra shampoo, razor, and barred soap. So this is everything for the shower. Oh, and a loofah. So that is the shower stuff. And that is going to go in to here. So this is a little overview. So this are those things I showed in the shower stuff. Then I have um, a face mask, my moisturizer for my body, my oil for my face. This is a, um, this is not Bari and Badescu. I have a coconut oil kind of like shimmer spray in here. Um, toothpaste, another moisturizer, loofah, hair ties, and bobby pins. So that's what's on that side. Then we have um, my face, SPF, the tea, dry shampoo. Oh, sorry, that's my face wash. That's my moisturizer. Eye makeup remover, deodorant, a mirror, tied to go, a um, pencil sharpener, um, nail glue, face razor. And then this has Q-tips and face um, cotton ball things. So that is all my toiletries, minus my toothbrush, which I will add in at the end. I believe this is all my toiletries. If I'm missing anything, um, I will put it in there, <laughs> but that's that. So these are some stuff that just don't fit in here. So I have Advil. I'm going to put it in a smaller container. Um, aloe vera. Shit. Sunscreen. My hair oil and hairspray and then I'm also going to pack my curler so I will do that but I need that for um for tomorrow because I'm going to curl my hair sorry my bathroom is disgusting um so I'll throw that in at the end anyway um and also I'm going to put a few ribbons as well so that's the toiletries oh and I found a little baby toothbrush so I'm just going to bring that guy just so it's packed so everything is in. I packed the blow dryer. Um, basically all that needs to go in here now is my makeup, but that will be done the last minute. So I hope you guys enjoyed this pack with me part of the video. And now I'm going to fake tan, but my no-no is outside, so I gotta let them in. out my nails so I get um, press-ons because I just don't like getting my um, nails done at the salon they just hurt too much so I think it's these yes okay so it's these guys and then I know they look kind of ugly but I just file them into a coffin and they look really good but you'll see I'll show you guys the process and it's 20% off and so $12.99 minus 20% what is that $12.99 minus 20%? Um, I want to say like $9. Yeah, pretty good. And you get two um, uses. Yeah. Wow. So that's what I'll do. It, but yeah, I'll show you guys how I do that. Um, anything else I need? But yeah, kiss meals. And I'll let you know if we get anything else. Bye. These are the little face razors I use to shave like my sideburns and like just peach fuzz. They're really good. Only 
actually it's kind of a lot for little plastic razors but whatever and then I also just getting some nail clippers <laughs> and we have chocolate each if you never tried if you're vegan this white chocolate to die bomb bomb.com I'm here too <laughs> <She is. laughs> Sabrina prep and pack featuring Kim featuring Kim Kim and Sab and to get our other things Oh, so I just put on those nails. This is what they look like, just um, regular without filing them. Okay, so they're all done. Nice coffin nails. Feels so good to finally have um, nails again. So, I don't know if I'm going to keep them French. I might go in and paint them. Um, white, we'll see, but for now, this is where we're at. Bye! Hey guys, just got out of the shower, shaved and exfoliated. Now it's tan time. So I'm gonna be mixing these two here because I get the best results from that. So Jergens Mousse in Deep Bronze and um. Vita Liberata in medium. This one's so good. The mousse is like phenomenal, but I only have this for now. And then I'm just using this mitt. So all over the body. Okay guys, so I just showered off the tan. This is where we're at. And I'm gonna put the last layer on. Okay, so just finished fake tanning. Here it is. Can you tell? Completely unrelated, but your girl's having a nice feast here. Bye!